What is up? Red Pill Racing. It's been a minute since I made my last video. I believe that was the one making the uh, BCR rail cars. Uh, what you're looking at here is some new cars I just picked up the last couple of days. I'm going to do a quick review on these things. By the way, DCRL went fantastic. First, second, third, and fourth for Red Pill. If you're new to the channel, we basically just uh, buy Hot Wheels, crack them and track them and the quote Chuck. Guy race with a lot. Uh, what I picked up today is that burnt orange bone shaker number seven. We picked up that rising climb number eleven. Cool little casting crew out of DeVille. We got that maximum leeway. Maximum. Finally found the S first. We got the Kroger exclusive Tour de Fest. Then one I was really looking forward to finding, the HW50 Concept. A little disappointed, I'll tell you why in a minute. Um, and then another anticipated a Dodge Challenger SRT Demon. So, let me uh, get this thing set up here. Like I said, if you knew, we don't do much editing here. We uh, pretty much do uncut videos. So let's look and see what we got. We're gonna crack these things open. Wait, and then we're gonna race them on a red pill raceway. I'm gonna also do a little weigh. See what these things weigh in at. Trying to work a little bit on getting my track set up a little better. So it's not so cluttered. Let's open the maximum leeway first. It's got the uh, metal base on this thing. It adds a little weight. Not a big fan of the wheels. No, it does not. Been hardly at all. Not as heavy as I thought it was going to be either. All my scale zeroes up. Maximum leeway is 28 grams. Let's go to the Kroger exclusive. Tour de Fest. Wasn't really a fan of this car before, but the graphics on this one are pretty sweet. These wheels are actually awesome. Listen to that. That's right out the pack. One of those from that new Malaysia plant. Tour de Fast DHP 35. So let's weigh him out. 34 grams. Next up, everybody loves a good bone shaker. Had to pick a few of these up, maybe modify. Uh, definitely to add to the collection. Another made in Malaysia car. And that, that new color, looking pretty sweet. Not just like the other, maybe 50 wheels. Nothing spectacular, it's gonna be light, it's 25 grams. That's what the new plastic bone shakers are, and they're light. Alright, next up, the Escort 50. Everybody's probably seen these at this point. I feel like I was the last person to get one. Not really an Escort fan, but the blue, blue looks pretty sharp on it. Good looking car, plastic base, a 70 Escort. It's going to weigh in 30s. Seven grams. 
uh, that last video, DCRL, and I was also showing my uh, cars that's going to be making an appearance at Race Mountain Speedway, 3D Bot Maker. See if we can get that king of the hill. End up sending eight cars. Four that I don't think hardly anybody's going to have anything for. And four that's questionable. I mean, they're, they're decent cars, but... I don't know, we'll find out tomorrow because I am next up. Here's that new Rise and Climb. Get a color on that thing. I like the make it. Of course, when I go to get that, I can't find it. I do like the way that looks. Sleeping better than the other ways in at about 33 grams. I guess we can do the comparison on these two. And I really like that blue, but no, I'm not as big a fan. I like that burnt orange. It's look good. That blue and orange, for some reason, looks really fantastic together. I wonder why. Kato. Ah, whoever developed these things has got to be a Gators fan. Come on now. <laughs> Next up. Uh, i got to get this moving here. I cool my light with a million things. That was too out of the bill. Long wheelbase, but man, this is a light car. Really can uh, suck you. Them wheels have been great, though. Another Malaysia car. That bad boy weighs in at 28 grams, really light. Like I said, long wheel best of a potential. I'm going to go about this day 50 concept. Now, I've been looking forward to getting this car. The four big wheels, the long wheel base. And these actually stand really good. But, who decided to put four wide tires on this car? I mean, who knows, I've mean, never raced one like that, maybe it kicked some ass. 32 grams. <laughs> Buddy, Mr. Mathis, MDG Racing, <laughs> said this car looks like a main line and a character car ran off and had a kid. That's funny. That's exactly what it looks like. Big old fat tires. Left up, this is Dodge Challenger. SRT Demon. I gotta say, the thing looks good. I also gotta say, people are paying crazy money for these things on eBay. And I picked up about seven of them today for 94 cents a piece. I saw a video of somebody showing this thing beating a uh, Pro Circuit John Force, but they only showed the end of the race, so I'm gonna call them bullshit. We're about to find out. Skinny wheels on the front, fatties on the back. 30, 40 grams. How about that? That's where I weighed one before. Yeah. So, what are we gonna do? We're gonna race them once in each lane. No rhyme or reason on how I'm lining them up. We just lining them. How I put them. I will keep track of the uh, fastest time on this. Uh, stay tuned at the end because I got a bunch of sets I need to race. We're going to do some pickums. Uh, anyway, let's do this thing, man. Uh, turn out finish line. Hot Wheels Racers. Line ready. See how cluttered I am. I've got so many cars. I've been working too much and <laughs> buying too much and not racing enough. First up, it's gonna have to be a quick. I'm gonna keep this video short. It's that 50 concept against the crew of the bit.
Hmm. He had to come back. Two, four, three, one, but he got him. So we're gonna swap. Two, four, three, one. That is not impressive. Run it again. Cruella's out. 50 concepts, man. 2, 4, 3. I ain't even writing that down. That ain't worth it. We go, go, bone shaker. Versus. I don't even remember the name of that quote at this point. <laughs> so, if you get on this channel racing, you're ready. I have a feeling that's going to happen. The way these wheels run. Really fast. A bone shaker actually ran a faster time than that 50 concept. 2417. That was a good run for the bone shaker. But this time right here might be very respectable. Pretty fast. That was actually impressive. That tour de fast ran up. Two, three, five, five, fresh out the pack. That's nice. Next up, that's your next round matchup. I'm going to write that down. Two, three, five, five. TDF. That's nice. What are we expecting out of that car? I'm going to go with that escort. Maximum Eagle. We still got our uh, bare muscle cars out that hurricane kind of put a bit of a delay on things with legal speed. But I know he's working on it. It'll be posted soon, round two of that. Now I got an escort, man. We got a 2382. That's pretty decent. I ain't even running these again because he got his ass smoked. He's out. This would be an interesting matchup right here. I'm going to do the Hellcat, Demon, whatever they calling it, and the Rising Climb. <laughs> now, before I opened these things, I was thinking that Rising Climb would get smoked, but a little quick wheel spin test. I think he's going to take them. Yep. Two, three, one, four. For the rising clown. Which is not terrible, but is not great either. So, two, three, nine, four. If this game wants to come back. He had him most of the way. Got ran down on the big end. So look at that. That's interesting, huh? Three of the winners were those 50th cards. Phone shaker lost, but probably to who will be the eventual winner, if I'm guessing. About to find out that 50 concept. About to get his shot at him. Toward the fast. I said, stay tuned. We're gonna pick a pick them race in a minute. Sort of fast, son. Winner, fast. Winner. Um, really kind of shocked at that. I bought about three or four of these. I wish I would have bought them all. Wheels like that. A few um, mod cars and race, you know. You find some cars with good wheels, you gotta buy them. Two, three, four, nine. Should be done faster. Then a two, three, five. That's good. Shit. No graphite, you can't really beat that. Who's he gonna face in the final? This looks like that escort from the first round times, but this ain't the first round. It's round two. Go. 
2384 for that escort. Rising Clown was trying to run him down, but he had a wobble. Bad wobble going down. He probably got one wheel that's a little off. 2384 for the Rising Clown to get on. Mm, he tried to catch him again. They ran a 2388. I keep running him, he might lose up. But for now, it's going to be a tour de fast. Oh shit, it's fast. And the escort. For the title. This ain't going to be that close. No, smoking. 2351. It's the best short champ. I ain't even going to switch them. If you race, if you build, Go to your Kroger, your Walgreens, whatever you got in your area. Pick some of these bad boys up. They roll. All right. Back to the next topic. We are badly in need to race some damn cars. So we gonna do a pick and race. I got just right here. We have the Kroger exclusive Nightmare Before Christmas set. We got the Walmart Hot Wheels set. We got that Target set. We got a Walmart Dodge set. We got the Kroger Gran Turismo. We got the Fast and Furious. We got at least eight character cars. And I'm still missing one of these, so can't race that guy yet. But so I get that we'll be racing that too. So I think we're starting with uh, so I might as well start with these because I haven't seen a lot of people racing them. <laughs> it's one of the few times well, I actually bought a few sets, but the wheels on this roll so good that I stripped them. And I look on eBay, and these sets are going for thirty dollars for the eight of them. $35, something crazy. So, let's see who your pick is for this. This will be coming up in the next couple days. That's the Street Creeper. It's number one. Number two is going to be that 69 Volkswagen Square Bag. We're going to rip and race these two. No graphite. I'll go with that Super Van. That's a cool looking van. And these cars. I don't know why I won't focus in, but these cars are made in Indonesia. Which I ain't never found a car from Indonesia. Midnight Auto. And they roll good too. Quick and sick. If I, like I said, if you're a racer, you're a builder, how to lead the speed. Nick, how about racer Mike? All my regular buddies that run. We've been these modified races. Boys watching, you better hit them up and go buy them because they are all going around here. Cool one. The seventh car. Cockney Cab. We're going to randomly set the grid on these when we run them. Last but right, not least, that power panel. So, put in the comments below. Um, shit. We'll, what we going, what I'll do, I'll uh, pick eight, we'll do eight sets, let everybody pick your car on each one. Uh, all those winners will race in the tournament at the end. You get a point for picking the winner, and if you pick the winner in the last race, uh, we'll have to see what the point spread is, but uh, we'll make that one worth a little more, and I'll put together some kind of some kind of prize package. We're close to 50 subscribers, which is crazy. We'll just fly by tonight. <laughs> Situation I got going on here with these uh, videos. I just ain't got time to edit. 3D Bot Maker makes the best production quality. I make the best cars. Ty, I don't think so. I'm, I'm trying though. I've got some things in the works. And I'm really hoping I got something for Robbie Colmford. I think he's the top dude right now. I haven't got my Fairmont back yet to run a D64 the last few months, but I did find the Tide car. Um, this past month, Maxzilla represented good. 
he had his uh, Luke Skywalker on Solo, whoever that is, Grand Fifth. And it was fun watching the bomb squad pass a bunch of fast cars. And he finished like eighth or ninth. I was outran in the heavyweight downhill. Brian 4114 raced and built a hell of a fast car. And so did Robbie. Both of them used uh, the base off of that GoPro car, put a lot of weight on it. And they just barely outran the OF 150. This F-150 actually came in fifth, which was my circuit car. Can't believe new kids picked that 57 because it's been running fast here. Really disappointing on that guy. Not even in the top 10. What was nice, the old rally cat was rolling. He was 6th or 7th. So overall pretty happy. Uh, Robbie spanked everybody's ass. But that's what Robbie does. He's a bad, badass builder. Uh, trying to run him down though. As you can see, working on it right now. See all these, see all these bags of cars. That's what happens when you got uh, just enough time to buy, eat, sleep, and go back to work. So. Make sure you get to pick in on these cars right here. We're going to start that point system. Shit, there'll probably be like three people to pick on this, but whatever. That'll be three people just battling it out for a little package. Uh, maybe I'll throw together one of these Gran Turismo's or a couple of treasure hunts or who knows. I've got a, I'll find out what you like. we we'll get something cool. Throw it down in the comments. If you ain't subscribed, go ahead and throw a like at this. Throw a subscription. Shit, maybe I'll get 100 million subscribers and I can retire from the hospital. More ER drama. Nah, just kidding. I don't know I'm doing this. It's fun. Cool people racing. Yeah. Missed the deadline for the uh, Ribbon Derby. He's working on a uh, little something back here, but didn't get it in on time. I think I'll even use it for the zombie apocalypse at D64. Uh, Got to get a Firebird done. A lot of races coming up, so. Uh, did after not finding a tre super treasure hunt for a while. Got one two days in a row with them Camaros. I used to sell these things to kind of pay for my Hot Wheels and whatever else. Before I graduated and started uh, actually doing nursing in the ER, I'm going to start collecting these things to see what I can get. Got my package from Michael Mathis. Good stuff. Uh, anyway, like and subscribe. Uh, see you next time. Check out 3D Bot Maker later today. See if that red pill racing car can take Mike down. Coming for you, Hot Wheel Racer Mike. You out.